Hello everyone, today I'll be teaching you how to make four different designs for automatic dispensers on the Bedrock Edition of Minecraft. For the first design, we have a Silent Whisper design. I'm not going to take credit because I did not build it by myself, but I will be showing you how to build it. But I will also leave a link to Silent Whisper's channel in the description and all. So basically, you just take all the blocks out. Take some blocks out, so the comparator takes the output and the thing does its job, pretty, pretty much. So it'll start dispensing items like this. This is what it looks like, and we're gonna head to the tutorial right now. The items you'll need for this flushing system are on screen. You'll need one comparator, three redstone dust, five any blocks, four co uh, repeaters, and one dropper. First, what we're gonna do is place the dispenser two blocks by the side, a comparator, a block, a block, a block, and then a redstone dust, and then a repeater, a redstone dust, and then a dust and a repeater. So repeater in front and a dust behind. So this is all you need for the redstone dropper. So the system. second design is just as easy, except it's going upwards. So you just have a comparator run to a piston into two observers. So for the third design, it's more of a lengthy one. It's a longer one than the others, and it it doesn't go too high. So this is more of a you don't want to have it up front, but you want to have it back, and it works. All the items you'll need for this dropper system is two observers, one dropper, one comparator, one sticky piston, and four regular blocks. Okay, to get started, you want to place a block, a dispenser, a block right here, a block right here, and a block above. A comparator looking like this. The two buttons have to be facing towards the dispenser. Put a piston, sticky piston actually, facing this way. Put Stack up your observers. Get down, destroy one observer, get below, and place it at the piston. And that's it, the dispenser system is done. So the next design is more of a longer one than a higher one. So vertically, it's not that tall, but lengthwise, it's freaking massive. But it is a bit resource hungry, so it's not my first choice of dispenser. For the next design, you will need eight regular blocks, two redstone dust, two observers, one dropper, one comparator, and one sticky piston. So to get started off, you're gonna wanna put one block, one dispenser, one block again, another block again, over, and then one block, comparator, one block, red block again, and then you're going to want to place a redstone dust there, a redstone dust there, a block again, a piston, an observer facing this way, and go on the other side. Ah, oh, I don't want to fall. No, nope, it's going to face the wrong way, so let's get behind and observer facing that way. So the final one is personally my favorite, even though the length, the longer one is more slim and like better. This one's just literally just a comparator running into a block and running into a piston. It's basically the same as others, but it's just flatter and it's less resource hungry. And for this final design, you'll need two observers, one dropper, one block, one comparator, and one sticky piston. So to get started, you want to place a dispenser right there, a comparator, a block, a piston, an observer like this, and an observer like this. This last one is my personal favorite because it's so like low and I don't have to really take up much space like height or anything height wise. So just to get it started off, let's just have it like that. Any item and it'll just dispense items out. And before we round off today's video, I just want to say please subscribe and like for more of these videos. At the moment, I know uploading is pretty slow, but I'll try to kind of keep up on my work. So... If you did enjoy or found this video helpful, then just subscribe and like, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. And don't forget to comment what farm you want to see next.